And welcome back to Prospect Hub. We talk about Mets prospects and the minor leagues. Uh, this is from SNY.TV. Mets prospect Brandon Sprout placed on AAA development list. Now, before we get this video, I need you to hit that subscribe button. And, of course, like the video. Sprout's season likely comes to an end with a career high 114 and one third innings pitched. It appears top pro pitching prospect Brandon Sprout. Sprout's season may be coming to an end as the Syracuse Mets officially placed him on the AAA development list prior to the Tuesday night's contest. For those of you not familiar, development list is often utilized to help organizations monitor prospects' usage and development while still allowing them to stay with their team and continue learning. It isn't very surprising to see the Mets utilize this with Sprout at this point in the season as he's already reached a career-high 114 and a third innings of work across three levels of the minor leagues. But it's certainly been a productive year for the righty, as he's been one of the best, biggest risers in the organization, climbing onto and into MLB Pipeline's top 100, number 39. So he jumped. And then to the top five of SMY's updated top 30 prospect list. Overall, he's pitched to a strong 3.38 ERA with a 1.08 whip, while striking 129 bats across a combined 23 outings with high A Brooklyn, Double A, and Syracuse. He did struggle a bit after receiving his promotion to Triple A, allowing four more runs in four of his six outings, also issuing two or more walks in all but one of those. Still, he showed the top of the rotation potential he possess he possesses, and it won't be long before he we will see him dominating at the big league level. Well, we'll see about that, but that is a very interesting development. I did not believe that he was going to get called up to, to the major leagues. I, I never thought that, because based on the fact that he was on an innings limit. Now, he's a four-year college player, so he did pitch a lot of innings in college. But, you know, teams should not be in a rush to bring up prospects, especially if they don't feel that they, they can maintain uh, the workload. And apparently, he struggled in AAA, so it had to have been a reason, not just because it was a new league, but... Thank you for watching this video. I have more videos on the Mets prospects. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later.